All right, good evening, Tony. I am joined today by Mr. Tony Cornelius. Tony is the son of the great legendary Don Cornelius. So great to meet you. How are you doing? It is a pleasure to meet you as well. Great. So let's talk about American Soul, Tony. I know you're an executive producer of the show. And tell me, why, why this project? Why was it so important that this project came into fruition? What was your, what was your motivation behind doing this? Well, you know, the project has been talked about for quite some time. You know, my father always wanted to do a film. Uh, unfortunately, you know, deals come and go. Um, we had hired writers in the past. Eventually, you know, we got to a point where he decided to sell the brand. You know, mm -hmm. The brand was sold to a private equity. And then the private equity sold it to Viacom BET. And because BET had done so well with uh, Bobby Brown story as well as the new edition story. Uh, it was kind of a match made in heaven. So uh, the executives at BET um, got together. We all put a team together, and uh, here we are with American Soul. Okay, so so Tony, tell me, growing up with such a great father, what do you remember most about the man Don Cornelius, your dad? What was it like growing up in those days? Well, you know, that's a very good question because, you know, he was a perfectionist and he understood the business. Uh, he raised me from the, from the bottom to the top. Uh, and he always talked about the fine points. Mm -hmm. And uh, because we all can do what we do, but it's the fine points that really matter in this business. And he was a professional. He really wanted to create a show that uh, show black people in a, in a positive light. Mm -hmm. And that's what Soul Train is all about, and I think that's what American Soul is about as well. So as a kid growing up, were there days that you went with your dad to, to work? I mean, were you ever on the show? Were you ever in a Soul Train line? <laughs> what was that like for you? Well, you know, me and my brother Raymond Cornelius, who lives in Chicago with my mother Dolores Cornelius, Okay. we kind of shied away from Soul Train because we really didn't understand what oh. it was. We didn't really understand and this phenomenon. Okay. Um, we wanted nothing to do with it, but, oh. but we were there, you know, and when you grow up as a kid, even though you're there, you pick up little, little tidbits of right. information. And that information obviously grew into something, and one day I said, wow, this, this means something. Soul Train means something. Mm -hmm. you know? mm -hmm. Well, congratulations on the project. I want you to tell me, what do you hope the audience would gain from this series? Well, what I hope the audience gained from the series is, is teaching lessons on what it takes to really be good at something. You know, what it takes to, to, to focus in on something and believe in something and create something for your people. You know, mm -hmm. my father was really an a instrumental in... in, in working at things where he wanted to advance himself and advance his people. Um, so I'm really just hoping that the audience, the millennials and those even younger than millennials, can take away a positive light. Mm -hmm. You know, not a negative light, but a positive light. And with that light, they can go off and create things of their own. Absolutely. Well, as I said again, congratulations on the series. We'll definitely be looking forward to watching it. Uh, as a matter of fact, Tony, I'm not sure if I told you, but I was an extra in the show. Um, I was an extra today that Kelly Price was on, on the set, and she had a lot of deep moments to, to go through. That's so, so my experience was very positive, and everyone at the set was just totally awesome, and they treated us very well. Great. Well, there's one thing I would like to mention is that my father died, actually, he committed suicide February 1st, 2012, and uh, I started the Don Cornelius Foundation in his name, Okay. as well as I'm a national board member for the American Foundation of Suicide Prevention. And uh, we've gotten together to do a PSA that will be airing as well mm -hmm. as part of the uh, American Soul. So I'm looking forward to uh, our people really understanding what the signs are mm -hmm. and what to do when uh, they meet someone or if there's someone in their family that has a suffering from mental health issues and or uh, suicide. Okay, can you give us a little information how someone can reach out to your foundation for... Um... Uh, they can reach out to my foundation, Don Cornelius uh, Foundation.org, and also uh, AFSP.org. Okay, all right. Uh, so I, I'm really looking forward to it. 
Thank you so much, Tony, and much success. And uh, we're hoping to see more and more episodes of the great show. I do as well. Thank you so much. You're welcome.